force being perpendicular to both the magnetic field and the what? Electric field, I mean, the direction, we have that, all right? Now, the aspect of the speed of the electron remaining unchanged is a marking point. However, the direction do what? does what? Changes, all right? So you find that it's going to be one, two, and a half, all right? Then obviously, we can also have another half this way the, at the end, all right? And this part normally takes you or gives you roughly three what? Three wonderful marks, all right? Now, we're going to talk about part B, or sorry, Roman number two. In Roman number two, it says that explain whether a similar path would be formed if a uniform electric field were substituted for the magnetic field. If we change and now our electron beam, which is again moving at the common velocity, instead of entering a uniform magnetic field, now enters a uniform 